I've been driving around a little while, you know, because I got out of my head sitting in the house, you know, with the coronavirus. Man, I just too much for me. I can't sit in the house all day. I go out of my mind, man. It's crazy. I've been being watching. I've been being watching, you know, like all the shows, you know, uh, Sanford and Song, where they work in the junkyard. That was, you know, the watching people that work at the junkyard, that's where they work hard. Like all the episodes from Love Boat. They used to get crazy, man. They used to party on the Love Boat. You know, I watched the, uh, the one with the spice, the show with the spice. I watched uh, Peaky Blinders, you know, those guys. I'm a bad guy, you know, but those guys, that's a bad guy. Those guys are bad guy. Where are I gonna get food around here, man? There's nothing is open. I don't want the crappy food. I want fast, I want fresh. I'm still picky just cause I'm living in exile and because I'm like under uh, virus protection, you know, doesn't mean I don't have taste in food. I like, uh, I like Roman, Roman shows. Mad about you, mad about you, man. What a revelation, Paul Reiser, you know? The lady also very, very good. Little angry, she's a little angry, but I like that show, Mad About You. I heard they're gonna bring it back. So I'm driving around, and uh, lo and behold, there's a Yemi Young, like four minutes from my house. Now I gotta go back to the house, you know, and uh, I'm not supposed to be out for more than like 10 minutes anyway. But I can just get the app, and they can deliver to my house, you know, five minutes. Sometimes I get recognized. They say, oh man, Tony Montana. I thought you died, man. I thought you were dead. I said, no, no, I ain't dead, man. I just moved to Iowa. That's it. Oh, another one. I got to tell you one that I was very disappointed. Madman. Oh, you got to see Madman. Oh, Madman is the best. Oh, I watched it. All seven, I think it's seven seasons. I must have spent a week. I didn't really see that guy get mad once. Because his behavior not the best, but I don't think anybody on that show really got angry. There's the guy now, he just pulled up. He just pulled up to deliver my food. The one I don't understand is Blind Date. It's like they're setting them up for failure. I don't even know, the one episode, you remember this episode with this guy Mark, and he liked reptiles. And they set him up with this beautiful makeup artist, uh, Jill, I think her name was. They know it's not gonna work out, you know? She's a hot makeup artist, he likes snakes. How is it gonna work? Another episode, they got a guy named Bill. Okay, Bill's a holic. He's a holic, he drank too much. Lauren, I think she's a little sarcastic, you know? They have like five shots of Jaeger. What they think is gonna happen? I don't even know what that's about. Not gonna work out well, man, you know? I got some faults, I got some faults, but I got etiquette. Whatever you gotta do to stay, you know, in control, keep your sanity. Whatever you have to do, bing watch, you know, get your Yimmy young when, uh, you know, they live like five minutes from your house, get your Yimmy young. I said to one of my friends, you know, get your Yimmy young. And uh, he just stopped calling me. I don't know if it's the virus or what, maybe he's sick. I should probably check on him.